Note, while the initial data preparation only required Alteryx Designer, you will need the Intelligence Suite installed and the separate Intelligence Suite license in order to complete the text analytics that are shown in the remaining videos. Remember, the software versions must be the same for Alteryx Designer and Intelligence Suite. Alteryx's Intelligence Suite makes text analytics accessible by transforming a highly complex programming process into low-code tools. In doing so, the end user can focus on answering important questions instead of learning how to write code. To illustrate this point, let's begin with creating and viewing word clouds. The text analytics tools that we need are going to be on the text mining menu. If you don't see the menu, you can use the right arrow at the top of your screen to locate the text mining menu. Drag a word cloud tool from the text mining menu until it is in front of the data preparation tool container. If necessary, make a manual connection between the data cleansing tool from step 11 and the D data input anchor of the word cloud tool. If an inappropriate connection was made, please remember that you can always click on a connection, hit the delete key on your keyboard to remove that connection, and then make the appropriate manual connection. In the configuration window, we're going to select the MDNA field. Selecting the MDNA field allows us to create a word cloud from the words on the MDNA disclosures across all firms. To view the word cloud, we need to add a browse tool after. Right click on the word cloud tool and then select the option to add browse after. Annotate both the word cloud and browse tool with step 12. Then save and run your workflow. After running your workflow, you should see the word cloud appear in your configuration window. If you do not see it, then just click on the browse tool to view the word cloud. Good job. You have learned how to create and view a word cloud using Alteryx's intelligence suite. Alteryx's low code approach allows you to focus your time on the discovery and critical thinking aspect of this process by using the word cloud to answer the associated questions. I want to remind you that I'm using an abbreviated data set, so my results can look different than your results.